Hey everybody, it's Alexandria. And I'm Michael. And welcome to Never Better Club. Today we're taking on six hot balls. Or more. <laughs> All right, so really excited. We've done six hot balls before. We've done it uh, once and then we did it twice, so. We did 12 hot balls the second time. Am I correct yes. or incorrect? Yes. yes, correct. We did multiples thereof. Multiple Today, time. we have enough to do multiples thereof. Yesterday, we kind of had the same dealio going on where we said, oh, let's do one and just see how we feel. And we're gonna see how we feel today. Yep. So that's the plan. We love these things. Michael and One I do. A lot of people hate these things. Um, I think Michael and I just like cheese balls. So <laughs> <laughs> these are really hot. They hurt. Yep. They do hurt very badly. Yep. And um, they smell not the best, but they do give you that same sensation of uh, eating, you know, Cheetos. So. And today is Super Bowl Sunday. So yeah, Sunday fun day. Which is very fitting. Yeah. Yeah, it's right. It's snack food. It's Super yep. Bowl snack time. Um, too bad we don't have a beer here with us. That would not be fun to drink while you're That's doing true. these challenges. Try it yourself. I won't try it myself. I just know it won't be fun. <laughs> so, anywho. Well, we always like to read the rules, even though we've done this. This might be the first time you've seen the six hot ball challenge. Yeah, so. and with that in mind, before we get into the rules, um, just take a look at the tube here. This is Johnny Scoville's challenge. There's six beautiful cheesy hot balls in here. Hot is an understatement, um, you know, fireballs is an understatement. I don't know what you would really call them. So let's go here to our challenge list. And go to the snack section. The gist of it, fire. from high levels, you eat a ball, you wait 60 seconds, and you do that until you hit the fifth one, mm -hmm. and after the fifth one, you do a five minute afterburn. Yes, that is the gist of it. And here we are. Um, formally, uh, you and your balls must remain on camera at all times throughout the challenge. Read the short disclaimer um, into the camera. You must video your challenge without edits. You must be seen opening your tube seal here. Where was I? Yes, no relief of any kind throughout the challenge, no eating, drinking, etc. So, yep, it's a five point challenge. I would like to formally request that League of Fire increase this to a six point challenge. Of course, not for my own game, um, but you know, there are six hot balls in here. It makes sense to me. Makes sense to me. All right, let's get the disclaimers out of the way here. I'll go first. I'm Michael Morgan. I'm over 18 years of age, of sound mind, and have read and understood the Hot Sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers, manufacturers will, under no circumstances, be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact without question. Very good. I, Alexandria Tersek, am over 18 years of age, of sound mind, and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact without question. Sorry, I hit you in the head. Too chaotic. All right, I'm feeling hyper. Let's do this. <laughs> Let's do it. All right, so here's... Michael here's hates the... getting hit in the head, you guys. Here's the first one. Like, it's I don't think biggest, anyone It's his biggest pet that. peeve ever, so I'm like... I'm, it's funnier than you guys right. understand <laughs> that I hit him in the head. Here is the seal. <laughs> okay, we're opening them. Let's do it. Michael loves to get right into it. Let's get right into it. No procrastinating, Alexandria. Hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up. You know, the right. hardest One, part two, is getting three, these. Four, five, six. How do you, you do gotta, this with gloves on? You get a break, like you pull your finger up. I found no, the no. edge, but what what do you normally do? There's a little area. Right, see where we can break this seal. I see the perforation. I always am aware of it being there. It's not in the easier to get off the line, I guess. Okay. There you go. Thank you so much. Chivalry at its finest. I'm trying. <laughs> Speaking of chivalry, Michael and I did have a successful date night last night with do, with doing um taking on only one Scoville yes. slammer. Hurrah! Yep. <laughs> <laughs> we, we got we got to have a bottle of champagne. We no one was cramping. Time, yeah, so that was good. not not even part of the time. It was yep. really nice. Um, so we successfully, yeah, just had a little bit of relaxation before 
this. I say we get right into it because we have plenty of time to chat here. Yeah. So, all right, let's do it. Three, right. two. I'm trying to decide which one. Hell ball. I want you first. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. <clears throat> there you go. <clears throat> Fine. Sometimes with these, you get lucky. And you get no dusty in your throat the first couple of balls, but I got it. And I'm like, oh, darn it. <laughs> it's there just, it's just, dust. it's just luck of the draw. Like sometimes there's ones that are extra dusty. Sometimes um, you breathe in at the wrong time. And man, it's fine. Cause I know it's going to get bad. These do tend to make me a little sweaty. You know, all the challenges are so different. Yeah. For me, this is definitely a sweaty challenge. Yeah. That's any why the, Michael has the... his headband on. Yeah, any of the dry challenges, they're they're just kind of sweat producing for some reason. We need to make sure that if we put up a little store one day, like just with a fun, um, with things like this on it, which we have not talked about, you know, if we were to do something like that, you should, we gotta put headbands on there because we need headbands, you guys. I would love my for own. For the men. Yeah. Or in the ladies. I just, I don't, you know, I don't know if ladies sweat as much as men. Maybe I'm wrong. Sorry. Uh, uh, <clears throat> oh, I'm sure there are women. Sneeze. Yeah, me too. I'm sure there are women who sweat a lot, but I don't. I don't just I just need to stop talking because I. <clears throat> that's just my own personal experience. All right, four more to go. You know. These are tasty. At this point, I'm I'm not a cheese ball. Um, sorry, a Scoville hot balls expert. But I'm on my way, and I feel like taste-wise, these are pretty good. But there is this like burnt aftertaste that happens, and I don't think it's the actual cheese balls. I think it's probably like the powder or something that's on them. Mm. It's the only complaint I have. Otherwise, they are so delicious. And actually, it's one of those things that you kind of get used to and it grows on you. I feel like we have things to talk about once we get to our burn period. We can talk yeah, about them. Five minutes. <clears throat> Like, I'm already sweating a little. Like, no, I'm a little. My you, this is yeah, I'm a little warm. Cheers. Ah. Ah. Uh. Halfway there. Oh yeah, no, it's just coming back to me because I'm experiencing it right now. Um, these cause me to get a frontal lobe headache. I don't know oh, why. That's interesting because you know, I sweat so much on my forehead, so. <clears throat> no correlation. I don't believe. I don't know. Yeah, I don't either. But, uh, but just, <clears throat> yeah, I don't think so. Um, it gets weird. Which other challenge did that to me? There's another powdery one or crunchy one. Maybe maybe one of the tube of tears gave me a little headache. Hmm. Hmm. How are you feeling? Good. Three left? Halfway? First tube? Yep. I think I'll definitely do a second one. Yeah. Um, I, the way I'm feeling right now, I should wait to um, say when we're actually finished with them after our burn period. So. Oh, yeah. Super Bowl Sunday. Yeah, Cheers. Let's eat another quick. saying Super Bowl Sunday. I have this shirt and I look like such a like football fan or something, but I don't watch it. I just <laughs> have a <laughs> have a, um someone special in my life that's named Sunday. <laughs> one of one of our little girls, her name is Sunday. So I call her Sunday Fun Day and it's funny because this is a very appropriate day to wear this shirt. It's definitely a building heat. Um, oh yeah, you're feeling it. Sorry, hon. I'm talking like it's like it's no big deal. Oh no, I just want to describe <sighs> how it feels. Um, yeah, you got the sweat thing. coming on. Um, I see it on your nose and your forehead. Yep. They are legit. I feel it in my stomach this time a little bit. Yeah. Not stomach bit. yet, because that would be right here. But I feel upper burning. Um, uh, probably esophageal burn. Cheers. Is how you would describe it. Uh, ah, I'm 
spread out. <laughs> Got the burn going, yeah, for sure. You just think about all these different types of challenges. I'm sure like some people that really like sweets enjoy like the chocolate ones, you know? Oh yeah. But I personally love savory, cheesy kind of food. So this is like one of my favorites. Yeah. It's just, I could just eat these all day. They're just so nice. The, um, the chocolate one, the all, every chocolate challenge is interesting. And Michael and I talk about it. Like, I don't know if we'll revisit those guys. Like, uh, and it's nothing against the challenges. They're, they're just, it's a lot it's a of lot chocolate. Of food, yeah. It's a lot of food. Um, we do, we do plan on doing everyone. We're, we're sitting on the Nemesis right now. Yeah, we are. Trying to find kind of the right on it. window of time. <laughs> I'm, I'm very aware of what's going to happen when we eat that. Um, yep. And you have to make time for those things. Chili Cherry Nightmare. That was um, all right going down very hard for me to stomach those last few bites. But here, I'll finish that thought in a moment. Oh, see how we do that. It's just consistency. Show the camera what you did. So we were gonna do a minute and then four minutes because that was our last wall. Yeah, it'd be really useful to have a second timer whenever there's like multiple times involved. You can have five and then. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm feeling it. <clears throat> feeling that mouth heat. Feeling the throat heat. My nose is running now. I'm trying to kind of stay focused on. Uh. Yeah, I don't wanna. Don't wanna think about it too much. Oh yeah, Chili Cherry Nightmare is um, <clears throat> obviously tricky because of the, the mass, um, the dried cherries in it, but um, something we never got to really talk about was when we did that challenge, um, there were cat cramps afterwards. Um, it, was, it was pretty significant uh, heat that came afterwards from it, and uh, they weren't horrid, but it's such a massive amount of food that I don't know you you're just caught you're digesting it for a long period of time right yeah <clears throat> so it, it's just like it, waves it was waves and it's because just, it took a while to digest it all there, yeah. there wasn't much you could do it's like when you think when you thought you're done you just get hit with a wave which yeah. is uh, not really yikes. characteristic of cap cramps I got some know. heat going on in my mouth there yeah Whew. these are hot yeah you just forget Sorry, that was gross. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and open this. Yeah, let's go for it. Here. You okay? Yeah, yeah. Just processing. All right. There's a lot of Oh, yeah. Sunday, Sunday. Actually, feel struggling. Some kind of warmth down in my stomach. Yeah, I think I um just did like a small burp to help. Don't mind me. Oh, I struggle here. There we go. You know, I find it funny. You have to have rules for all these things and it's very important. But like, honestly, if people were doing these, I'm not experiencing some sort of bodily symptoms. Oh, by the way, here, these are empty. That's how you would know that they were uh, messing around trying to fool you because you can't escape it. If you're not sweating, you're drooling. If you're not, yeah. ooh. Also, is it really something the effort it would take to tamper and mess with it? No, not, not in my mind. <clears throat> Stolen valor. <clears throat> <laughs> that's what that's called. Man, I feel it. Why don't you um, tell me if I'm valor? Um, I was going to say you can wipe your head, but it's not for me, for you. I'm fine. Ah, yeah. I'm gauging my stomach right now. Yeah, how are you doing? Are you, I mean, you're you're gonna do the second one, right? You're gonna. Yep. Okay. Hoping 
so it burned. It's right there in a second. like a break from the deep fresh house. I don't mean a long one, like a day, like 24 hours. Let your stomach yeah, rest. Let my stomach rest. That's literally what I was thinking. I mean, you read my mind, but. It is funny because in these challenges, like you do take a few days off. I, I've sat here and felt no stomach pain, but I, I really do feel warmth in my stomach right now. And I, I can't ever recall. Michael and I challenges. ate a baller breakfast today. I mean, it was amazing. Uh, we had, wait, now I can't talk again. Um, and there's this breakfast place in town that's super good and um, their chef's stellar and they had it's funny they have this um, out of all the things on the menu very there's everything's good but there's one thing it's called uh, just vegan breakfast hash and Michael and I always order it and like put a bunch of eggs on top of it <laughs> <laughs> and uh, but it would be good without the eggs too yeah. Brussels, Brussels sprouts and black beans and cashews Cashews, nice. uh what else is on there P breakfast potatoes it's super delicious covered in like this glaze and just piping hot and then you get the crispy egg you not well sunny side up like crisp eggs on top super good um so we ate that today you know trying to get a good base in us and even before that i had um two giant blueberry muffins i just been eating all day today um Uh, uh. uh <clears throat> muffins. What else? Just snacking before breakfast. Oh, and then when I came home, I had Michael and I had oatmeal. We always do our lime juice before. You have um, a lot of oatmeal these days. Yeah, more than I ever imagined ever consuming my entire life. Do I enjoy it? No. That is kind of a short it. answer. Every time I make oatmeal, I kind of <sighs> experiment with different ways of preparing it. <clears throat> Which is kind of fun. <laughs> I'm an oatmeal girl. I eat it though, daily. Some, well, sometimes every other day, but these days. At least daily. twice. Uh, the key to, to prep, you prep ahead of these challenges, but it's really important to eat right after the challenge. Kind of encapsulate whatever you, whatever spice you're dealing with. Absolutely. We got some feedback today about your markers on these videos. Um, I forget who it was. Someone said they really appreciated it because oh, you know then the they chapters. got yeah they can yeah. you can scrub then yeah. which Cheers. everyone does. Uh, or look for um, interesting moments because they're marked. Yeah, I put the markers in the videos because when we get a post on Illegal Fire website, you have to indicate where the challenge actually starts. Yeah, it's easy. So it's for helpful everybody. for that reason, but then also when you're watching it, you can kind of move around. So kind of a double benefit. So I feel like I'm going numb. Originally today, I was like, I'm going to eat hot balls until I can see, or sorry, hear colors. <laughs> <laughs> now I. What do they always call them? The death nut challenge level three is question your commitment. I think if you're doing multiples of um, hot balls, second tube is question your commitment. I got the drool going now, like, it's not fun. I do have to think though, like, Oh, 
always the question, how much can your stomach handle? Yep. How do you find out? You push yourself to the limit. That's how. Ugh. Do you want to push yourself to the limit every day while you do these? No. You know that if you take on League of Fire challenges yourself. Ugh. are burning a little bit right now. I don't feel like I got any guts left. It's a lot of... Ah. Uh. 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 <sighs> mm. Some of these challenges all of it's subjective. I think most of them are fairly ranked. Um, I do, I'm just being genuine, I think this is a six point challenge. For one tube, it's a five point challenge. Maybe there should be like a, a bit of an exponential jump when you go to the second tube. because It gets really hot. stomach burn. Last one. Chew it and don't think about it. Cheers. Reset my hands. Yeah, that's what my hands. It's good to have multiple gloves with you on hand because you go blow your nose, and one of my biggest fears is just getting powder in my eyes. Yeah. <clears throat> Freaking out, you know, on camera. So we come. Ooh. We've come to a crossroads, my friends. <laughs> and we have min minutes left to make a decision. Do we do a third? Do we stop here? Oh, I just burped, that's nice. Yeah, it, do it is nice when you burp. I'm gonna do a third. <sighs> Wish I could pause this video and just talk to you for a second. You know, it's hard. I just, I mean this too, it's like no excuse at all, but like, it is hard doing these and being a parent. Because I get to the point where, can I do a third right now? Yeah. Can my stomach handle it? Yes. And my mouth can too, even though it's on fire and I'm drooling. But, um, I start thinking of my babies. And, uh, this is Michael's challenge right here, and I'm thinking like, What's the chance you can do the four? I don't know. Probably. <sighs> Probably. Okay. <clears throat> With Honestly, that in mind, as long I, as I'm not like yep. crazy calf cramping, I. With that in mind, I'm not going to do a third tonight, guys, because um, I don't want both of us. We don't have a babysitter, and my parents are not around tonight, so um, that would help a lot. If we did have that, then. It's uh, nap, I would do three. It's nap time. Um, yeah, right now it's nap time. Everyone's asleep. Michael's good at <laughs> making sure everything is this close. Um, anywho, what I'm trying to say is I, I could do it. I really could. I think I'll do it again soon. And then, <coughs> power. Maybe Michael will bow out early and let me um, do more. Or we'll get my parents to come over and watch. But, um, oh my gosh. Oh yeah, we can do that too, um, which I'm happy to do. It's <laughs> this is fun. Uh, yeah, cap cramping and trying to bend over and take care of three babies, like three. 
<laughs> Bottles, diapers, you know, all that. Hey, I, I gotta be the one to step up tonight. Cool. Well, I'm gonna stay here, you know, for emotional support for you. Yeah. This is a different video. I've never done this. Um, I'll just kind of hang out. I can get you paper towels now, and, like be your support person. Um, and I'll take care of the kids if I see any of them get up on their baby monitor. <clears throat> Who knows how long Michael will sit here. We could be here all night. <laughs> I don't know about that. No, we'd run out of product. Oh, excuse me, the burps. <sighs> oh, the heat's coming down, that's good. Heavy salivating. I like these, I do, they're really growing on me. When we did our first one, um, I'm probably gonna, by the way guys, I'm probably gonna take over talking for the most part now. Uh, oh, it hurts. When um, we did our first one of these, Michael was like, this is my thing. And we did two of them and I was like, oh, this is okay. And now I'm like, oh, this is fun. It is fun, it's tasty. But it's tasty and it's, it, it brings me joy, so. Um, mm. Another multiple we're looking forward to. Oh, oh, wanted to say because I heard uh, several shout outs on your video. Sundance, uh, you recently completed the Tube of Terror 2.0 and congrats to you because that's not an easy one. That's a hot one, yeah. Yeah, it's a hot one. We're happy to see you complete that successfully. That's awesome. But um, I, know, I know on your um, ledger, you know, things to do, you we're talking about um, Trouble Bubble, and you already did four of them, and I think, from what I understand, you might try it again. Um, Michael and I are definitely gonna try multiples. We'll see if we can do two or three. Um, uh, so I'm gonna get to it. Yep, get to it. Awesome. Cool. Go, Michael, go. Yes, ah. I think we'll do Trouble Bubble, too, because was we had a lot of fun doing that one. Yeah, we have a number of challenges on our way. <clears throat> I can drink now. The nougat. Is that how you pronounce it? Uh, yeah, nougat. To be nougat. kidding me, it's oh. nougat. Yeah. And um. Yeah, that trouble bubble. Right now, y'all are in for it. Michael's gonna be unhinged. I, he's a cheerleader now. <laughs> Five more vials of hot balls. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know. I don't know if we're ready for that today. Also, I don't really want you to be sick. It's hard to watch. I do hear a baby waking from their nap. Which one? I'm not sure. Could be any of them. I may have to depart for a moment. Are you okay with yeah. managing? You yeah, know, you're only on a third. Yeah, so it's not like you're shaking. I think I'll just check on, I think that's my, let me check, I can check my camera. I don't know what I'm talking about because I'm not doing a challenge right now. I thought I heard my little buddy, his voice. And if that's the case, he probably wants to play with me. Play on his iPad. It's getting late where we are here, so. We've had a busy day. No, actually, it's a beautiful day where we are, too. I say that a lot, but nice enough, in the winter time, we were at the park today. We all, it was really nice. We had day. a really, really beautiful day together as a family. The high great. of 57. High really... of 57. In winter time, where yeah. we live, it's not, we usually, we usually have um, six inches of snow outside right now, but it was 57 and sunny, not a cloud in the sky. What am I doing? Got to check on Bub. Mars man. My, my little future chili head. He likes to tell me all the time, uh, Mama, don't drink too much hot sauce. You go to a hospital. <laughs> he tells it to him too. Uh. Oh yeah, I'll be right back. All right. Be right back. Enjoy, Michael. It's probably gonna be a little bit more silence with me <clears throat> as I endure. These uh, hot cheese balls, so. Whew. 
weird. Um, Mal's pain is um, very low. Still feeling, feeling some heat in my stomach. That's going to be the question. You know, typically calf cramps usually kick in like, at least for me, 45, 60 minutes after the challenge. Um, so if you sit through enough of these, of course, you'll start hitting that kind of wall. But with no post prep, I'm really curious, you know, when you do a lot of these. Uh, when you do a lot of <clears throat> multiples, like once you kind of hit that 45 to 60 minute wall, what happens, you know? Because at that point you would have had no food and you know, usually we do some lime juice and oatmeal after, so. <clears throat> so cap cramps is really gonna be the question here. Everything is well, you need anything? Good right now. Yeah. Wow, you're doing great, Michael. Two left. Two left. You know, for for the amount that you've done, you're not sweating that much. Yeah, I was just saying my mouth is fine. Um, my mouth was fine too. The, the proportionality between the heat in my mouth and the heat in my stomach is a little off kilter. I feel a little bit more heat. I think so. <clears throat> Ooh, did that help? That always helped. The, 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 I don't know if that. Okay, I'm gonna burp too. <clears throat> The burping on this challenge actually helps. I've never like loved the sight of lime juice so much more. I know. You're not um makes me wanna gag. I never uh, realized until I started doing these challenges how many things <coughs> make me repulse when consumed in mass quantities. Yeah. Ah, lime juice. <clears throat> Sometimes I think I'd rather consume an extra challenge than oh, than lime juice. Yeah, I don't think you know. It, this is a. I think this is a bit of a stomach challenge, really. I mean, gosh, it's hard to explain because mouth pain's pretty intense. It, it's a real burn, you know. It's not. I don't think there's capsaicin crystals in these. I'll double check for our for our friends here. Um, I can see well today. That's always nice. Sometimes I cannot. Ingredients. Oh no, we've just got some really intense peppers in here. Conveniently, the Best Buy sticker is like right on the list of all the hot peppers. But it looks like ah. Uh. All right. Looks like there's so many different types of super hots, like distilled down into a powder and put in here. Okay, I don't see, I don't see, um, oh, that's yeast extract, never mind. Yeah, yeah, no, no, um, crystals in here. The world's hottest cheese ball, chase the heat. Indeed it is. You know, I love things like this because the, the, I, I do feel like um, this is, yeah, this is a Johnny Scoville challenge. Johnny Scoville, if you ever hear this, which you probably won't. Most people will scrub through this part. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, you should make a little bit of a toned down version, like something that doesn't make you want to throw up after you eat the whole bag. Um, but like a super, super hot cheese ball that you could just eat because Michael and I would buy it. Well, we would just keep it in our house at all times. You yeah. have to keep it away from the kids. How's your stomach? You okay? You doing it? Yeah, a little bit of heat down there. Do another. Burp again and do another. <clears throat> I know you I know you've got this. Like I know you. You you've got you've got one more in you at least. Yeah, I'm just trying to engage my stomach right now. It's... This is this is it though, Michael. Like this, there is a point where you're you're gonna suffer stomach consequences, and you're at it already. So right. why not cross over? You've got to, you've got to that point, is what I'm trying to say. If your mouth is okay, 
when you feel like you're not immediately in distress, are you, or, I mean, are, are you cramping? Maybe a little bit. You're warm? You're warm? Yeah, warm. I just kind of feel things kind of moving around in there. Yeah. Yeah, actually, it's funny, time-wise, so the, the burn periods in between these would, would make that a, quite an issue. The more I think about it, because yeah, if we... Yeah, so I'm in a 45 to 60 I mean, minute kind of wall, you know? And, and with that in mind, I need to make sure it's safe. So interesting, like no mouth pain right now. Just total, total stomach. Yeah, that's that's definitely heat. Twenty minutes to go left. Forty-seven seconds. Are you? You want me to open them? What are you doing? No, I think I think that's it for me. You're done. Yeah. Okay. I'm All cramping right. pretty bad. Oh I don't know no. Food, but. All right, guys. Well. With, well, let's get get you off the camera here. Uh, I know we're counting down, but we'll cut it off pretty quick here in 30 seconds. Thank you all so much for watching. Um, if you don't already, please subscribe and follow us. Michael and I um, have more cheese ball challenges in our future. We also plan on doing some hot pepper um, personal challenges soon. We're talking about doing some local uh, hot eating challenges as well uh, within a you know two hour radius of where we live. So, um, just some things coming down the pipeline here. I uh, hope you all have a happy Super Bowl Sunday, whatever you got planned. Have fun with friends and family. And uh, we'll, we'll just yep. see you soon. Yeah. Thank, Thank you for you. watching. Bye. Bye.